Welcome to our Growth Mindset series, where we explore the power of embracing challenges and fostering resilience. Join us on an inspiring journey toward personal development and success. In our upcoming episode, discover the remarkable story of Misty Copeland, a renowned dancer who defied the odds and shattered barriers in the world of ballet. Her unwavering determination and relentless pursuit of excellence will leave you inspired and motivated to unlock your own potential. Misty Copeland was born in Kansas City, Missouri in 1982. When she was young, she moved with her mother and siblings to San Pedro, California. There, she joined her middle school's drill team. This was Copeland's first formal experience with dance, and she was very good at it. But she needed more training if she wanted to get better. At age 13, Copeland signed up for free ballet classes at a local after-school club. She easily learned choreography, which is the steps that make up a dance routine, and was able to perform it right away. Soon Copeland mastered dancing on point. This is a difficult ballet move in which the dancer bounces on the very tips of her toes. Copeland began taking intense summer ballet courses at different dance companies. Despite a serious injury, she continued perfecting her talents. She worked hard to become the best dancer she could be. In 2000, she was invited to join an exclusive training program for young dancers at the world-famous American Ballet Theater. In 2001, she became a member of the American Ballet Theater's Performing Ballet Company, the only African-American woman in the group. She became a soloist in 2007. In 2015, she was named a principal dancer of the American Ballet Theater. A principal is a star ballerina. Copeland was the first African American in this role in the 75 year history of the American Ballet Theater. She cried tears of joy when the news was announced. Her hard work had paid off. People have called Copeland a dancing prodigy, a very special, unusually talented dancer. Does that mean that she did not have to put in effort to get where she is? Why or why not? Copeland showed special talent for dancing at a very young age. What is your special talent? How do you work at getting better at it? Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey of growth and resilience. In episode 14 of our Growth Mindset series, next week, we delve into the profound topic of working through our fears, uncovering strategies to conquer obstacles and emerge stronger. Join us as we embrace challenges and push beyond limitations. Remember, as Misty Copeland beautifully said, the fear of failure can be paralyzing, but only if you let it be. Stay tuned, keep growing, and we'll see you next week.